believe, can we believe that I'm wearing both these foundations, okay, and they're dupes, okay? This is a drugstore dupe for the Estee Lauder Double Wear Foundation. What? So, I'm super excited because one, my big head cannot fit in the frame. Hello, welcome to big head life. It's how God made me. Rah, rah. I'm wearing this denim jacket, which the fur I'm obsessed with. If you guys follow me on Instagram, you probably see it all the time. I know on social media, it's like, you can't wear the same thing twice. I'm like, well, you know the deal. Let's get some things out of the way. First thing, if you're not subscribed to my channel, make sure you subscribe down below. Two, give this video a like if you like dupe videos. Three, make sure you leave a comment down below. Let me know, because I'm have some things planned in the, in the works. Hello. Let me know what's your favorite makeup brand, drugstore and high end. All right, guys. So I found a dupe for one of my favorite foundations ever, literally. So this is the Estee Lauder Double Wear Foundation. I love this foundation. It's full coverage. It makes you look flawless. It's long wearing. It comes in about 35 plus shades. But okay, I found a drugstore dupe for it. This is the new Maybelline Superstay Up to 24 Hour Foundation. It's definitely more of a long wearing slash full coverage foundation. My color in the Estee Lauder Double Wear Foundation is Rich Caramel, and then my color in the Maybelline Superstay Full Coverage Foundation is 355 Coconut. So just to test this out, and so you guys, my friends, can see how this foundation is a dupe for the Estee Lauder Double Wear. I'm gonna do half my face with the Estee Lauder Double Wear, and the other half of my face with Maybelline. I love dupes, so if you want more dupes, make sure you thumbs up the video and keep on watching. I really can't believe how my top knot is not in here. Like, come on, frame, get it together. So I'm just gonna apply the Estee Lauder Double Wear to this side of my face. Oh, the Estee Lauder Double Wear is just such a medium for full coverage foundation. Like, I love putting on makeup and going full out, full on out, but also, I love doing a natural finish. But today is full on, baby. To blend out the foundation, I'm gonna be using two different brushes. They're both from Morphe. This is an E54 brush. Dabbing motion to blend out the foundation. And you guys can see how beautiful this foundation blends out on the skin. Wow, I just love this foundation so much. We're gonna move on to the Maybelline foundation. This foundation also comes with a pump, which is really cool. For the Estee Lauder foundation, you have to buy a pump, so that's awesome. Put some on the back of my hands. Hello, maybe I'll need more. And I'm just gonna apply this to my face. I feel like these two foundations are literally the same color, which is amazing. I definitely have to say, I feel like the Maybelline one feels a bit more fuller coverage. Now to blend out this side of my face, I'm using the Morphe E31 brush. It's just a smaller foundation brush slash flat top brush. And again, just use dabbing motions to blend this out. All right, so the both foundations are on. I know, it's too legit to quit. Like, what? For my concealer today, I'm gonna use the one that I've been using for a little while now. This is a Colab No Flaws Concealer, and this is in Mocha. I'm just applying this under my eye. And then I'm just gonna blend it into the skin using this Real Technique sponge. I'm gonna use this sponge on this side of my face. This concealer blends out like a dream, legit. And then blend out the other side. Then I'm gonna set my under eye of my eye using a translucent powder this is the Too Faced peach perfect powder now this is a mattifying loose setting powder i really love this powder because it's really lightweight on the skin and it's translucent so it works on many different skin tones and it won't really change the color slash add as much coverage it will just really be to mattify the skin i'm just gonna apply this under my eye and then i'm just gonna blend this into the skin by using dab emotions I'm also gonna apply a little bit on the forehead area. That became my nose area, hello. <laughs> and do dabbing motions to blend this in. This helps the product not to move all over the place, especially the foundation. All right guys, so I just finished doing my makeup and I feel like both sides of the foundation look superb. I'll just do a little face to face so y'all can see how it looks. Okay, so this is the Estee Lauder side, which is this side right here. And then we have the Maybelline side. Is it, I'm shook. Right now it's around 2 p.m. if y'all can see. And I'll be back in in about five hours to double check so y'all can see how it looks. It's that time of the month, so that's why you see these little things. But it's a part of life, breaking out, girl. 
we all break out just to be real all right guys so it is a nut time a little window right here is it over here i don't know if y'all can see i think it's right there so i've been wearing this foundation for a couple hours now and i have to say i haven't touched up even on my lip color or even on my eye makeup or anything i haven't touched up on anything and now we're gonna do a side by side so this is the estee lauder side and then we have the maybelline side i hundred percent hundred percent have to say this is a dupe okay i absolutely love both these foundations you guys know i actually did a full review video on this maybelline foundation so if you want to know more information about it definitely go check out that review video this is a hands down 100 percent for me a dupe okay i know a lot of you guys are on budget and you don't always have time to spend 42 dollars on a foundation that's why i like dupe videos okay it helps you to save a lot of money Plus, you see, half of the high-end brands own drugstore products. They just market it to a different market or people or life. Huh. Yeah, but I will say Estee Lauder does not own Maybelline. Maybelline is under the L'Oreal brand, if you're wondering. I know that because I went to school for cosmetics marketing and chemistry, so I studied all that, okay? <laughs> Hello, gotta get my facts ready. But if i had to recommend this to you as a dupe i would say a hundred percent yes make sure you check it out something you should definitely try out even test it out yourself okay if you have the estee lauder double or go to sephora and get a sample of this foundation in your color get the maybelline foundation test it out half by half or half face half half yeah you know what i mean girl test it out and see if it works for you because i feel like it's a hundred percent a foundation do hundred percent i love both of them the only thing is that estee lauder has definitely more colors estee lauder has about 35 plus colors in this collection and the maybelline has 16 colors i believe in this collection i do feel like the maybelline goes on a bit more like heavier than the estee lauder one it goes on lighter in the sense that how it feels on the skin but it's still full coverage you're both still full coverage there you go so if you're wondering what's next what do i do after watching this video why don't you click on another video girl strawberry lemonade here okay i like those little packets that you like have water you put your strawberry lemonade in it and or the little it's like it's that crystal light but it's not it's another brand it's from Rite Aid that i get it from but yeah just sit grab some juice some water sparkling water coconut water i love too and watch another one of my videos hello I love you so much, and I'll see you guys soon. Bye.